episode seven. I know you guys missed me. Um, I'm very sorry that I'm a month late, um, but this is the Snacks of Life, a snack crate review by yours truly, Scotty Joe Gardner. Um, thank you guys for tuning in, and I can't believe it's been seven episodes. I started this series in August. I think that's super cool. And thank you guys, everyone, for your support. Um, I know that some of you guys watch my videos because you guys have been asking me where this freaking episode is. But it's here! It is here! Welcome, welcome. If you guys are just tuning in, um, I have six other episodes on Facebook and YouTube. Look up Scotty Joe Gardner. Thank you so much. Um, and what it is, is that it's a monthly um, snack box from anywhere around the world. You can know where it's from. You don't have to know. And that's my choice because I love to be surprised every single time. This video is done in one take. There's no edits besides the music and everything there, which is kind of cool. Um, and nobody really watches it. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Well, I am so glad you guys are watching it now. This is, again, episode seven. Normally, I have different cocktails every month, and today's cocktail is green chili vodka. I think I've used this one before, but get this. Okay, so I was at Target, um, and by the way, this is where I got my cute little glass. It comes in four colors. Four dollars. Four dollars. This is when I was supposed to go buy one shirt and I came out to $200 worth of stuff. Yeah, we won't talk about that one. Um, so anyway, so, and I got this cute little sparkling mojito original. See that right there? See that right there? Yeah, I didn't know that it was non-alcoholic. So here I am drinking all these and I'm like, I don't feel a thing. And then I realized, it was non-alcoholic. So what I'm doing now is I'm going to mix the sparkling mojito in this green chili lime vodka um, into my glass. So let's start off. Um, again, guys, thank you so much for starting this. That's all I need. Um, and for watching this video, it really does mean a lot because I do this, again, just for fun. Um, I love trying new snacks. I go on adventures once a month. Um, and speaking of adventures, um, episode eight is actually going to be filmed as well, probably in the next few days and also um, posted because I'm going to be gone in Scotland. I'll be going to Scotland and, and London for two weeks um, and I'm so excited. I have never been, a, I've never flown across uh, the world and I've never been out of country and I got my um, passport my first time and I hate my picture. They don't, yeah. The girl was like, you can't smile. And I'm like, why? And she's like, just smirk. And I'm like, okay. And that's how my picture came out. Anyway, now I'm gonna pour in my vodka. That's probably a shot or two or whatever. Now I'm gonna mix it up with my finger. Anyway. Oh, God, whoo. All right, cheers. Whoever's having a glass of red wine or a cocktail watching this, watch it, you know, when you have nothing better to do. Like me, because I'm doing these videos. Oh, oh. Whoa. Oh, that's good. That is very good, Minty. These are really good, guys. These original sparkling mojitos, non-alcoholic mixers, very good. All right, guys, here we go. Are we ready to know what country this is from? I kind of, I kind of figured where it's from because, you know, every single time you, they send you a box, it says, hello or something in another language. And this one says, bonjour, bonjour. So I'm guessing it's from France, I think. That's what they say, yeah, bonjour, bonjour. Yeah, 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 France. 
Um, oh, look how cute my candle is. This is actually from a resident. Um, uh, it smells really, really good, extremely strong, but I like how it comes in a nice box. Um, and I got my two lights out here from my studio. This is um, Studio on a Dime. <laughs> These are two lights without the covers on it. And Alex and Lucy are in the bedroom because Lucy is getting a little anxious because she's not used to this. But anyway, let's open up this blue magical box. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. All right, here we go. Bonjour! It is from France. Guys, I got my snack crate from France. I am so, so, so happy. I love France. Ooh, we got some macaroons or macarons. What a little French guy there, the Eiffel Tower. Paris, that's where I wanna go. All right, so let's open up some fun facts about France. Capital is Paris, perfect. The colors are blue, white, and red. Established in Fort 486, Ugh. population is 67 million, and fun facts, potatoes were illegal. Ah. In France for 24 years in 1748, the French parliament forbade the potatoes on the grounds that it was thought to cause leprosy. Anyway, I am so hot. Woo. All right, guys. Again, it is from France. Let's dig in. So each, um, so these are the snacks that are coming in this box. Um, it's either a 24 pack, 16 pack. Um, so I'm going to announce every single snack. I got the mini, including with the original and the drink. Um, Honey, my drink is in the fridge. Just kidding. I got my drink. Um, all right, so let's get started. So I'm gonna put this here. I'm gonna scoot this here. Sorry guys, I'm just really excited. I haven't done this in a while. Okay, so first up we have, again, I'm so excited for this box. So excited. Um, Want more snacks from France? You can like, have all this stuff. And they come with stickers. Each time they come with stickers, which is really cool. All right. <laughs> Speaking of potato chips. All right, first up, we got Lay's. We got Poulet Roti. Poulet Roti. I don't know how to pronounce these, so please, all my French friends, forgive me. Um, but let's read it here. So it's Lay's Pole, crunchy and savory potato chips flavored with delicious taste of roasted chicken. So I'm pretty sure this means roasted chicken. All right, here we go. Wow, great crunch to it. It literally tastes like chicken. Like, think like chicken. With gravy. It has that gravy taste to it too. Oh man, that's great. That was my Lay's flavored with chicken. All right, next one. Oh, hi, Barro. Hi, Barro. Do, 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 do. Something, something, Alboro. Anyway, these are the origin, Originia P, P, I think, P, P. All right, delicious chewy gummies, flavored with zesty orange flavor of Oregano soda, which is probably what this is. Um, let's try this. I love, love sweet stuff like this. It's sour, it's sweet. Ooh, this one says spicy. Oh no, that not this one. Anyway, let's try it. Smells good. Looks like two little wine bottles or wine glasses. I'm gonna try two because they're stuck together. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. I don't really taste the orange. Maybe it's because I had two flavors at the same time, but it is very sweet. And very, I love that sour taste. It's very good. Very, very good. All right. I'm gonna put the soda, because remember, my sodas are always last. All right. All right, so my next one are these cute little muffin things. Amor de Glace. Cute little, looks like little cakes. They are the, oh, they're Madeline's. Really? Oh yeah, they're Madeline's. The name Madeline was given to these sweet and buttery cakes by King Louis in honor of the royal chef, Madeline Palmier. They're really cute. All right, let's try this. I'm glad it comes in two so I can have Alex try it. Mm. Oh. Oh, wow. That is buttery. It is sweet. But you get that hint of butter first. Ooh. Hint of butter first, and then you get that sweet and then it mixes in your mouth once you chew it. But have a glass of milk with that or a cocktail because it's very, it's very moist. I love that word. And the wood booger that makes me laugh. All right, anyway, so that's another one. So that was of the Madeleines, super good. All right, so next we have Sunday. Nestle Sunday. Here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, so this unique treat is made with crunchy corn flakes formed into a bar and dipped in dark chocolate. All right, so let's try this. Corn flakes. Never was a really big fan of that cereal, but let's try this. Dark chocolate's my favorite. Mmm. Mmm. I love the crunch. You taste more of the chocolate than you do the cornflakes, but very good. Nestle Sunday Bar. Sunday Fun Day, even though it's Thursday night. Oh, that's really good. And I love crunchy things. I love chocolate, I love crunchy. You know what's really funny? I've never gotten a, I mean, the only U.S. box that I got was from Hawaii, but I wonder if, what snacks the U.S. puts in. I wonder if it's like Butterfingers or, anyway. All right, next one is called Nuts. Nestle Nuts. I got my nuts. Speaking of nuts, I'm not wearing any pants. <laughs> anyway, anyway, okay, so this is Leslie Nuts. Milk chocolate candy bar with a filling of caramel and hazelnut. Ooh. A lot of these countries love their chocolate and hazelnut. This one doesn't have a lot of chips though, which is cool. All right, here we go. Looks like a little Snickers bar from the outside. Mmm. 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 Very. Very light. That's a good nut. Some good nuts right up there. Look at it, look at it. All right, so, so far we've tried the chicken, the chicken, the lace chicken, the nuts, the hairborough, the madeleines, and the Sunday bar. So far my favorite honestly has to be these chicken chips. It is super good. I love the sour. So I'm getting some sweet, some buttery, some sour. I love that in every single box. It's so cool how they mix it all together. Okay. My next one is, these are little small candies. Ooh, I don't know what this is, but 
There's a little emoji with fire on it. I'm not sure. A little nervous because the last time I had something fire, it was not good. You guys remember my video when I did that Choco Challenge? The Choco Loco Uve Suku Fe Ave Swa Challenge? Holy uh, bajoli. So I'm really nervous, but it's called T-Test Berlice. T-Test Berlice. Um, these hot-headed candies are coated with intense sour flavor, but reveal a sweet inside. Can you take the heat? I mean, that's what it says. Okay, here we go. The same candy. Woo! That is sour and it's stuck to my teeth, so I'm gonna be talking like this on the rest of the video. Oh man! Karma bar. So the next one, cute little thing, looks so scared because I'm about to eat them. <laughs> These colorful, chewy candies. Feature a mix of fruity and sour flavors in every bite. What is up with these sours? And I'm like salivating. I'm literally drooling. Anyway. Guys, thank you so much again for watching my video. We are almost done. Um, but if you guys have any questions about the snack crate, ooh, just holler at me. Okay. I just, first of all, I ate the, I ate the wrapper, and um, that was intense. Mmm. Holy shit. If you guys are not a fan of sour, I do not recommend this. I'm gonna put that right there. Whoa. All right. All right, next one, I can't really read it, but something, Something pocket. We got something pocket right here. Um, is that, what is that? What is that? Oh. Crunchy, sweet, and buttery cookies with a layer of chocolate. A French favorite since 1897. It is called Petite Eclair. Oh, it smells good. Oh, look how cute these are. Oh, it broke. That's cute. So you had a cracker. You got business in the back, party in the front. Anyway, all right, let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. Petite. It tastes kind of like a, it's crunchy. You have, it is buttery and chocolatey. It kind of tastes like a, like a graham cracker with chocolate. Ooh. All right, I got three things left. I got two in the box and I got my soda. I hope you guys are enjoying my video so far. Um, Wanna know secret? I actually get nervous filming this. I don't know why. I don't know why. All right, so. All right, so we got Mi Mikado. Mikado's kind of looks like Pockies. Country biscuit sticks dipped in pieces of caramel and milk chocolate. Perfect paired with a cafe ole. Ole. I got my cafe au lait. Mm -hmm. Guys, this is really good. Get it. Get it. This is a Target. All right, so let's... It looks exactly like Pockies. So let's try it here. Put this down here. All right.
So this is what they look like, totally pocky, but this says caramel. Mikado! I think that was, that was bad, horrible. All right, now we got the real chocolate. Abonle des nos regions. I am probably saying it so bad. Chocolate Francis since 1848. Um, so it's a popcorn chocolate bar. Oh, oh my God. Anyway, I just farted. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh man. We've included one of the three decadent flavors from this favorite, famous French chocolatier. All right. Oh, it says open here. Okay, this might not be tried yet, honey. Um, I need your help. All right, so Alex is gonna, uh, thank you, honey, thank you so much. He's gonna work on that for me for a little bit. So, while he gets that, um, I really wanna thank you guys very much for, um, thank you so much. Um, he's so good. Um, I really wanna thank you guys so much for joining this, uh, in episode seven, it's been so fun filming this. Um, and you got to see me burp, you got to see me fart, you got to see me sweat. This was so sour, super sour. I can't wait for Alex to try all this stuff. Um, so far, I really love, um, I really love the chicken chips. I really love them, I don't know why. And I love the, um, the sours, again, I'm not the sours, the sweetness. All right. So now this is open. Let's try it. Here. Let's try it here. So this is a French favorite. Mm. You know, each month I try a lot of chocolates. So sometimes they taste like the same, but for some reason this tastes really, this tastes really good. Viva la France. It tastes like chocolate. <laughs> Alex goes, what's it taste like? Chocolate, milk chocolate. Um, it's very, very good. And there's three different flavors. So I'm, I'm guessing I just got the chocolate flavor. All right, guys, so we are at the end of our video, and then before I go and taste my soda, again, I wanna thank everyone for joining me in the Snacks of Life, a Snack Crate review. Um, episode seven. I know it's been past due. I'm so excited to film episode eight as well. I have no idea where that's from. Um, it does say hello in some language, which I don't know. I'm thinking it's Japan, but I don't know yet. Um, so far, I've had Turkey, Canada, Hawaii. Um, I've had Switzerland. I've had France. I've had a whole bunch of others. It's gonna be listed um, on the credits of this video. Again, if you don't know what Snack Crate is, you can try a box. Um, right now, Snack Crate was um, offering $1 for a box to try. But if that doesn't happen, it's $5 and you'll get hooked. You'll get hooked. It is so, it's so amazing. It's so fun, try, try it with your loved ones, your kids, try it by yourself, um, and film it. It's super fun. All right, so last on my list. So this is a genie, a genie lemon. So let's see this here. The hottest of cold drinks. This French favorite features a fresh of sweet lemon flavor with a delightfully fizzy finish. 
I got scared when it said the hottest of cold drinks. So let's try it. Oh, it's kind of like 7-Up. Tastes exactly like 7-Up, but not that carbonated. Perfect. So that right there. Guys, again, thank you so much. Look at all my snacks. Um, I know this video was pretty long, um, but thank you so much. Again, this is from France. If you guys have missed any of my other videos, episode one through six, go on uh, YouTube at Scotty Gardner and Facebook. Just look at my videos. It's posted everywhere. Like it, share it, watch it, love it. Um, again, I will see you next time with our episode eight of the Snacks of Life, a Snack Crate Review by yours truly. Again, before I wanna leave, I keep saying again before I wanna leave, but um, happy Mother's Day to all the beautiful mothers out there. Um, I wanna reach, reach out and shout out to my mom, um, Patty Ann. Anyway, mom, I love you and happy Mother's Day. And your birthday's coming up too. Um, so I love you. I love all moms. Alex is a mom because of Lucy. I'm a stepmom because of Lucy. So happy. I am sweating. Um, so I'm going to leave. Thank you guys.